window. You know you're supposed to be up by now. Your alarm clock just went off and like, like five minutes ago and you know that. Come on, get this, get this sleeping mask off. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> Frito, you can't go back to sleep now. Come on, baby, we gotta get you up. We gotta get you ready for school. Are you ready to go to school soon? I know no one likes school, but come on, let's go. It's Friday. Tomorrow's Saturday. Oh, there you go, you good boy. Let mommy just get your bed all ready, and you can, I guess, just start getting your backpack together. Put your notebook in there, your folder and stuff, okay? Mommy's going to get your backpack ready. Just go ahead and get your stuff all ready. Okay, let's see here. Wow, he made a mess of his bed. Didn't you, Frito? It's okay, you like to sleep. Okay, so let me start by taking these pillows and putting them over here, okay? Did it make a mess of these pillows? Fluff them out, okay? I'm gonna put them on here, okay? Then I'm gonna get his pillows Put the two blue ones like this and the yellow one like this with his face mask here, his little mask. <laughs> Looks beautiful now. Burrito, do you know where your um, sun cap is so that you don't get too hot when you're at recess? Are you sure you don't know? Are you sure? Okay, well, get downstairs. I'm going to be right down for breakfast. I guess you could spend just five minutes on the TV. I'm just going to clean up a little bit more up here. Okay? Hmm. His sun cap was here just yesterday. Hmm. Maybe I'll try cleaning under the bed. Hmm. Okay. Hmm. Let's take a look under here. What is all this? Huh? My shoe? He stole my shoe? Ugh. Ugh. Does not smell very good. Ugh. Mm -mm. Okay. A magazine? A horse magazine? No. Oh, wait. No, wait. That's his home. Oh my god, okay, okay. My socks. Why are my socks under here? My oven mitt. I've been looking for these everywhere. Oh, that Frito's gonna be in trouble when I get downstairs. Ugh. Let's see what else is under here. Oh. My. God. His bed, or who, whoever's bed is this? What is this? Uh, mm -mm, not that anymore. A doll. Oh, mm -hmm. Okay, what, whatever, it might have fallen. <gasps> His sun cap. His sun cap is here. Are you kidding me? What? No way. That Frito's in so much trouble for lying to me. And today he's going to be so grounded after school he's not getting one little piece of dessert. Hmm. Ugh. Oh, well, Mr. Frito, do you want to guess what I found under your bed this morning? Do you, Frito? Well, why don't I just tell you for myself? Well, I found your little sun cap under your bed. Do you want to explain what that's all about? Oh, I'm sure you don't. 
Well, anyway, what do you want for breakfast? I know you're tired, Frito, but hey, look on the bright side. You just go for a couple hours to school, and it's Friday, so you get to finish your homework when you have free time at school or a recess if you want to. And then you can relax, do whatever you want. And yes, Frito, I'll make you bacon right now. Fine, you can go on your iPad for a little bit upstairs, but just for five, ten minutes until I'm done cooking your bacon, okay? Okay. I'll start making your bacon right now. Oh, and Frito, can you bring your lunchbox down too? And your backpack? I need to fill your lunchbox up for lunch at school. Okay. Thank you, Frito. Okay. And I need your backpack. Okay. And yeah. Okay. Looks like you filled it up with everything today. Now you're not missing anything, right? Okay. Now you can go upstairs and enjoy. I'll call you down when it's time to eat for breakfast. Okay, so Frida wants some bacon, so I'll get out the pan here, and I'll put it on the stove here. Okay, perfect. Now let me get the bacon out of the fridge. Let's see here. Ooh, the fridge is not that full. I guess we've been eating a lot. Or should I say, frito has been eating a lot. Anyway, where's the bacon at? Okay, so let me, oh, oh, the bacon's here, okay. Here's some bacon. Now let's go cook it. Okay, Frito, how much bacon do you want? You want two pieces? Okay, like two, two, like, oh, four. Okay, okay. 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 I'm gonna have some bacon too, so I'll make three for myself. Okay, let's just let that sizzle. Okay, that should be fully cooked. Okay, well the bacon's really sizzly. Okay, so I'll get my spatula because they're really hot. And I'll put it, oops, and I'll put it on a plate for both of us. Okay, and I just need to put this in the sink. All right, Frito, breakfast is ready. Hey Frito, here's your bacon, eat up. Good morning, class. Hello. Good morning and happy Friday, everyone. Okay, so today we're going to start off our day with a spelling test. Okay, so I passed out each of you a blank piece of paper. Right, guys? And here I have my little answer sheet. So... Of course, you're going to take a pencil out, and what I'm going to do is, like always, I'm going to read out the word to you, and you're going to try to spell it correctly, hand it in to me, and at the end of the day, you'll get it back. Okay, class, you can begin on your spelling test. Let me read through the first one. Get your pens open and write your name at the top. Okay, so the first word is going to be horror. Take your time and please write that down. The second word is going to be volume. Okay, so we're almost done, okay? So the seventh word is library. Please write that down. Okay, now we're on the twelfth word, okay? The twelfth word is theater. Please do that. And then the 13th word is orange. Please do that. Okay, and the last word, which is number 20, is volcano. Okay, please write that down. And once you're ready, hand me your test. Okay, please hand it in to me and close the caps on your marker. Or whatever you're using. Okay, let me take yours, Luna. Okay, thank you. And I'll just collect these and look it over later. Okay, so it has been 45 minutes and we are pretty much done with class. And 
Frito, are you sleeping? Frito, what's the matter there? You know you're not supposed to be sleeping in class. You know better than that. I'll let it slide this time. Okay, so now your math teacher's gonna come in and she is gonna teach you some math. Be on your best behavior and I'll see you later. Hello, class. Hello and happy Friday. So, I'm gonna pass you around a blank piece of paper. Oops. Or you can take out your math notebook. If you don't have your math notebook, then I'll give you a piece of paper and let me know if you don't have your notebook. Okay, so it looks like everyone has their notebook out. Good, now you're gonna take out your marker, your pen or pencil, and we're gonna do some addition problems. Okay, so the first problem we're gonna do is four plus one. Can anyone tell me what that is? Okay, Frito, you think you know what it is. What is it? That's right, Frito, the answer is five. Good job. And we're gonna write down five on the board. Good job, Frito. Okay, now we're doing three plus four. Can anyone tell me what that is? Yes, Lily? That, uh, 12? No, Lily, you're actually do, uh, multiplying. Four plus three, can you try that again? I know now, it's seven. Okay, so we're gonna do two plus three. Can you please tell me what that is? Shout it out together. Five! That's right, class, that is five. Oops, and this one was seven. <laughs> Good job, so that's it for today's lesson. Did you all write it down? Yes, I did. Okay, good. You too, Frito? Okay, good. All right, so now it is supposed to be art time. I believe Miss Sage told you um, that your art teacher wasn't supposed to be in, so she's coming in right now, and I guess you can do whatever for now. Have a good weekend, everyone. Okay, class, you can do whatever you want for these 45 minutes, okay? Since your art teacher won't be in. Yeah. All right. All right, class, now it's time for lunch. Go ahead and take out your lunch and eat. Dad, look at me. Dad, look at me. Frito, aren't you gonna eat? Your food looks delicious. Are you sure you're okay? You won't eat anything. Okay. Oh. Oh, did you drop some? Oh, you're you're eating it. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, Frito, you ate everything. Good job. Okay. So now you can have a little bit for recess, and then it's gonna be time to go home.